I still in Lagos, Evans' girlfriend, Amaka, speaks with Crime Watch on her relationship with Evans and the allegation by his lawyer that she was sexually harassed by the police. He's my friend. What is his name? His name, according to what he told me, his name is Chukwebuka. Yeah, Mike. Mike, yeah. I met him at the um, free station. I went to buy field here. Yeah. He approached me, so I gave him my number. Then he started calling from there. We started dating after some time, so now I gave him chance. We started dating. That's all. How long was the relationship before this happened? Let me say a year. A year plus. A year plus, yeah. Okay, what, what did he tell you he does for a living? That he imports, um, he imports, he's into uh, importing and exports, then he's into oil and gas too. That was what he told me. Was he it, was it a good boyfriend? Yeah. Taking care of you? Yeah. Like how? Just tell me. As in, the, as in the things I know about him, he's a good guy. I couldn't even believe, you know, when I saw, when I heard about, when I heard from the police that, that he's a kidnapper. I couldn't believe such because he was a very good guy. He's a very good guy. As in the way he advised, as in the way he talks, many other things. If he advised you here, the way he advised, and so many things. But as in, I can't, I, even now, sometimes I'll still be wondering if all, all the things I heard about him is true. Mm. Was he a, a large, a, a big spender? Not, not like that, sure. Yeah. But anything I need to do, okay. I won't deny the fact that I love him. I love him because he was a good guy. Did you know he was married? Did he tell you he was married? Okay. Yeah, he told me. Okay. Before Evans was arrested, mm -hmm. what happened between you and the police? I was going out to buy something and they stopped me. They blocked me and picked me and said I should enter inside the car. They said that they want to get a... Um, they want me to assist them to get a vans. They said I should tell him, I should tell him to, come. yeah, or I should find a way to tell him to come. So, so they will catch him. When so that they will catch him when he come. Yeah. So when you called him, did he suspect anything? Just I can't tell. Okay, but he came. But to me, no, he didn't. He didn't know. Okay. Yeah, he didn't come. But to me, I, I believe that she suspected that something was wrong because of the question he was asking, on, asking me on phone. It was around 5 o'clock. I was sleeping when uh, one of the policemen that were in my house knocked. So he told me that my phone was ringing. I answered the call and it was advanced. He said I should come outside. Outside the... I should come and meet him at the main road. That I should not... Off hang the phone. I should just answer the call. Yeah, hold the phone and come outside. So I went outside with barefoot. I wasn't even wearing slippers. I went outside. I thought he was standing in front of the gate. But when I got there, he was parked at the main road. So I now went there to meet him. So when I entered the, his car, I started shaking was like, what happened? Why are you shaking? <laughs> I couldn't say anything. He was shouting. Uh, he was asking me, Amaka, what happened? Why are you shaking? That was when I now opened. I opened my mind. I told him that, see, oh, I don't know. Some people are looking for you. There are some men there. And they came to see you. They said you are an armed robber. You are. So he now zoomed off. He zoomed off. When we got to... As in, he was driving very late. I was telling him to stop that. I need to go back and go back. So when we got to, I can't even tell where the place was. When he stopped me, when I, when I got down from the car, I saw two women there. I asked them, I asked them where 
Where yeah, the place? Well, they said that um, like Is it 5 a.m. or 5 p.m.? 5 a.m. Wow. 5 a.m. Okay. okay, have you met his lawyer before? No. So where did you get all this allegation that... Uh, I can't tell. Have you read the story? Yeah, you I saw it yesterday, yeah. When so you what's your reaction to it? I was shocked because I don't, I can't tell where you got that information from. I d have not seen the the lawyer before. I don't know. I have not seen him. Seen I've never met the lawyer and I didn't tell him anything. So I don't tell, I can't tell where you got the information he wrote on the internet. I saw on the internet. I can't tell how, where he heard this from because I've never met him. So everything, are you saying everything he said about the police, your, the way you were treated was a lie? Yes. Everything he said is a lie. Because nothing like that happened. They, nobody touched me. Are you saying this under duress? No. Were you, were you briefed on what to say? No. Okay, so what you're telling us is exactly... Is the truth, yeah.